Who were you back in the day, you know what I'm saying, when your parents were playing music? And who were you guys listening to for the most part? Who were your parents showing you? Uh, my dad, he was really like, he had all types of, you know what I'm saying, tasting rap though. Yeah, yeah. Like it was just rap music, but it's like from everywhere. Like you would get in my dad's car and you would hear, uh, it would go from Boys in the Hood to, you know what I'm saying, yeah, yeah. DMX to, you know, like it was just like, it's cold, full circle. It's cold, full yeah, circle. Yeah. You get to like the Texas shit, you know what I'm saying, when my uncle started listening to Chopped, Chopped and Screwed, screwed and all, you know what I'm saying? So it was like very well rounded. Like me just growing up on music, you know what I'm saying? Like, but I remember like, Everybody used to, like, as much as I'm a whole fan now, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Squizzy is the one who's like, bro, you have to listen to hoes. And I'm like, he cool. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. I was young and I didn't understand. I didn't understand. As much as I felt like I understood everybody else, I'm like, I hope you talking about some shit. I don't know what you're talking about. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, then yeah, yeah. I get older and I start listening, like, yo, he's crazy with this shit. You know what I'm saying? So, like, that's like, but we listen to everything, bro. Everything. Okay, now, nah, Jay Z's a goat, man. For real. Mm -hmm. But, so you growing up with um, AP and Squizzy? Squizzy Something been, like Squizzy been my nigga since the third, third grade. Third grade. Yeah. And then you met AP high school. Yeah, school. I met AP like, like early high school. Okay, what high school did you go to out here? I went to, <laughs> I got kicked out of Overland my first week. Oh, <laughs> shit, I was supposed to go to Overland. Yeah. But then, you know, all my family and like, all my, all my dogs, like they was all that other, we was all separated at school anyway. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like Squizzy was at TJ, okay. like a bunch of my homies was at East, you know what I'm saying? AP was at Montbello. Yeah. So it was like, you know, we was all spread out, you know what I'm saying? We had homies who went to Central, okay. like Hinkley, Gateway, like yeah, we was yeah. everywhere type shit, you know what I'm saying? So after I got kicked out of, we got kicked out of Overland because we got, it was a fight. And then it was like, they realized like, yo, you don't need, your address ain't even in this district. Yeah, You know yeah. what I'm saying? They're like, you gotta go. <laughs> you gotta go. Yeah. Man. So I ended up at Rangeview, way out. You know what I'm saying? So I'm at Rangeview, but it was like, bro, Aurora Wild is like Denver is, bro. No, for sure. For sure. Twins, cousins, whatever you want to call them. Yeah, yeah, Aurora yeah. And Denver, same thing. It's, it's a little wild. different, but it's the same thing. They have brawls at East, we have brawls in Aurora. You know what I'm saying? Like, it was like we were going through the same shit, but I was like, I was like, my parent, like, my mom, especially just knowing, like, because my mom ain't stupid. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, my parents ain't stupid. So they like, my mom had me at 18. Okay. You know what I'm saying? My parents had me at 18, so they like, nah, we ain't risking it. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. We ain't risking it. And I still fucked around and had my son at 19. Right? <laughs> I was about to bring that up. Well, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. No, that's real. So growing up, you know, you playing sports, whenever you start getting to high school, you're making music, linking up with two other legends in Denver, yeah. AP, Squizzy. So around this time, are you like starting to really get into the studios and stuff like that? Yup. What I'm studios were there? My first studio that I ever recorded at was this dude named Tone Scarfo. Okay. Tone Scarfo, he rapped too, like super dope. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but that yeah. was like my first time being in the studio. He's like, I'm gonna record you, you know what I'm saying? We go. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, all right, cool, we in there, we coming up with some shit. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, I feel like that was like my first project that I ever like really put together, you know what I'm saying, and came up with. And then, what was uh, that project? Fuck, I think it was called Takeoff. Takeoff. <laughs> yeah, because my dad's ass. Yeah. So then, uh, you know what I'm saying, we had that project, and that's when I started recording with Miracle Child, too. So me and Miracle, you know what I'm saying, that's when this is, a, like, everything just went in order, like, yeah. Box Boys. You know what yeah. I'm saying? The Box Boys was, like, the first group. And they like, y'all so nice. All the young, nice moments came together in Denver. Like, we about to blow out of this motherfucker. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. And it was, like, me, fucking six. Tenor, Keys, uh, AP. Hey, and, uh, yep. No, no, uh, Tenor. Tenor. Name okay. was Tenor, yeah. Okay. I'm trying to I'm about to say, that's, a, that's an all star lineup right there. Yeah, yeah. Me, yeah, Six, right. Miracle, Keys, Tenor. Colorado Miracle? AP, yeah. Okay. AP. And then, you know, we had like my cousin OB, he was rapping. Like, we just had like, you know what I'm saying? It was just yeah, like yeah. the homies. We was just putting shit together. You know what I'm saying? So, we came out with an album. That shit was like AP, I mean, Priest. Priest oh, was a part yeah. of it. Yup. Priest? Yeah, he's bro. A, he's a legend out here, too, man. Yeah. With the, what was it, Kid Ink? The Box Boys was all legends, yeah, bro. Yeah, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, when, when, when that the Box Boys thing was done and we all went our separate ways, like, legendary status. You feel me? Like, everybody, though. No, for sure. That's really what we got on. You know what I'm saying? Like we was like, okay, we about to make this shit shake. Oh, yeah. Like that's just what it was. So 
But that shit was a, it was a dope time, bro. It was a dope time in like for like Denver music. You know what I'm saying? We was performing everywhere. We was doing video, putting shit together, like all that. Oh well, yeah, I mean y'all definitely some of the like real legends out here, and you in specific really like you said showed the world that yeah Denver kid could really do this. Yeah, we could do you this. Know you know what I'm saying? Like it don't matter where you're from, you could do this. Right, right. You could do this. But that shit that's dope to just think about like where we came from. <laughs> no, for sure. We've been putting shit together for years, bro. That's crazy.